From Tampa Bay Streaming News Source, brought to you by AlertTodayFlorida.com, this is ABC Action News. It's going to be a good Florida day. Expect lots of sunshine as you head out the door. Your weather forecast with Shea Ryan is coming up. Good morning, I'm James Tully. Here are your ABC Action News headlines. A Hernando County High Schooler just weeks away from summer break dies in a crash. FHP says 17 year old Garrett Herman was driving south on US 19 in Wikiwachi when he attempted to turn left onto Country Road. A truck collided with his car. The passenger 16 year old Seth Leathers died. The driver of the pickup truck was able to walk away. FHP continues with its investigation. Also this morning, Governor Rick Scott is ordering flags across Florida to fly at half staff in honor of former First Lady Barbara Bush. Her son Jeb Bush served as Florida governor from 1999 to 2007. A private funeral service will take place this weekend in Houston. First Lady Melania Trump is scheduled to attend. You might want to check ABCActionNews.com before you make breakfast. That's where you, we have the specific packaging numbers for the Publix brand eggs now included in a huge recall. The recall is for some 18 packs of extra large eggs. They could be contaminated with salmonella. Uh, we'll be waiting to learn if there are any local cases of people getting sick. Other brands were previously announced in the recall. We also have those on abcactionnews.com slash recall. The Lightning coming back to the Bay with a big series lead. Three games to one on the Devils thanks to a game four victory last night. The Bolts falling behind early 1-0 but eventually would score three unanswered goals including an empty netter with about 110 left. Nikita Kucherov having himself a game, scoring twice for his seventh career multi-goal game. Andre Vasilevsky dominant in the net, recording 27 saves. If the Lightning win Saturday at Emily, they will move on in the Stanley Cup playoffs. Now here is Shea Ryan with your forecast. Good morning, Shea. Good morning, James. Take a look at uh, what we're seeing today. Lots of sunshine again. We're starting off on the mild side this morning, but through the afternoon, we'll still make it to highs in the mid 80s. No rain in sight just yet. Now we do have a weak front that's going to be approaching tomorrow, but it doesn't look like it's going to have much impact on our temps. So expect this warm and sunny trend to be continuing with only slight chances for rain as we head into the weekend. James sounds fantastic. Thank you, Shay. You can get all of your news updates all day long on your favorite streaming device. And also don't forget to download the free ABC Action News app. Have a great morning. Don't they know they're supposed to use the crosswalk? Hey, you on your phone, put that down until you cross the street. Whoa, stop! Can't you see there are pedestrians crossing here? Ugh, I can't take it anymore. Drivers, put your phone down. Be alert. Watch for pedestrians, especially when approaching a crosswalk. Pedestrians, always use the crosswalk and push the button so I can help you cross safely. Alert today, alive tomorrow, because safety doesn't happen by accident.